A few years ago, Mr. and Mrs. Ziegler were spending a quiet evening in their cabin beside Flathead Lake in Montana. Suddenly, they heard waves crashing against the shore outside. When they rushed to investigate, they could see a strange shape splashing water over the end of the pier. It seemed to be rubbing against the pilings, almost as if it were an animal scratching its back. While Mr. Ziegler ran for his rifle, Mrs. Ziegler inched down the pier for a better look. Suddenly, a horrible creature with terrifying head emerged from the water. Mrs. Ziegler screamed, and her husband came running with the rifle. The creature turned and swam away with great speed, leaving a large wake behind it. When the Zigglers reported the incident, people suggested they had seen a log or big waves. The Zigglers were positive that they had seen a live animal. Does some sort of monster live in the inky deeps of Flathead Lake? The Zigglers are not the only people who say they've seen one. As long ago as 1920, fishermen in Flathead Lake complained that something huge was tearing their nets apart. In 1963, two teachers out on the lake in a small boat reported seeing a dark gray object with three humps. When the teachers reported what they had seen, two other women admitted that they had seen the creature on the same day. Through the years, more than 100 people have said they saw a monster in Flathead Lake. The Flathead Lake monster has been compared to the Loch Ness Monster of Scotland, the world's most famous lake monster. Although it has yet to be identified as any creature known to man, the Loch Ness Monster has seen, been seen by thousands of people. Scientists have studied Loch Ness and have concluded that it would be possible for a large creature to exist in its water. Flathead Lake is much larger than Loch Ness, and the same types of fish live in the two lakes. Could it be that Scottish monster has a cousin in Montana?